Well, the rain uh, is coming down now, but the workers are out there still planting trees. Right, I'm talking to Lynn Davis now, who's the street scene manager for Conway. And uh, hello, Lynn. Thank you very hello, much Dave. for talking to me. Can you just tell me a little bit about Pentram Park and what's going on here today? Uh, yes, yeah, certainly. Um, Pentramar Park is our biggest park in Abergelly, um, a big green, uh, green space that was developed um, in the mid-century uh, to cater for the needs of the local population. It's changed over the years. Um, it was quite a formal park and then with the problems with local government finance, the investment in the park reduced and the infrastructure declined. We're now in the process of trying to reverse that decline and to improve the facilities in the park. To that end, we've got together with the local residents, we now have a friends group in Pentramour, and with the police, we are, we've organised this first environmental day in the park. And what we're doing today, we've invited people to come here, uh, display their, their wares uh, and their stands showing the, the range of opportunities for the environment and we've all, we're organising tree planting in the park. Well that's excellent, uh, obviously the weather isn't very good today Lynn but uh, thank you very much for talking to me, I really appreciate it. Thanks for right, I'm here now talking to uh, Shelley, Shelley Coyle and Mike Priestley Mike from Conway Mike. County Council and uh, can you both just tell me a little bit about what's going on here today, you first Shelley. Okay we're here to promote all the different recycling schemes that are available in Conway County Council um, we have the green boxes where people can recycle their glass and cans and paper bags. There's garden waste and there's also this new pilot scheme for plastics and food waste which is to 7,000 homes and um, we're hoping to extend it to um, 4 to 7,000 um, next summer. Well, that's a lot. Mike, uh, what have you got to say? Uh, you're here today, uh, obviously a big project going on in Pentramount Park. What can you tell me? Well, the first thing what I'd like to say is uh, just recycling at home, I believe, makes the residents of Conway more environmentally aware, and that's why we're here to support this scheme here today. Fantastic. Well, thanks both for talking to me. I really appreciate it. Thank you. This is Superintendent uh, Richard Brough, who's a uh, partnerships officer, and he's going to uh, symbolically plant a tree here in Pentramar Park. We do one at a time. Yep. It's okay, like a true though. gentleman, <laughs> as the Lady Mayoress. <laughs> That's how you do it. Do I look like I shovel a lot? <laughs> <laughs> and done like a true lady. And here's uh, Councillor Mike Priestley. Doing what needs to be done. Pupils of Uskol Elvod are preparing a hole for a, a tree. And here comes the tree, an oak tree. This needs to go a bit deeper, I think. Nearly deep enough. And then comes the job of filling it in again. Right, I'm talking here to PC Sharon Thoroughgood. Uh, she's the uh, community beat manager for Abergelly. Hello Sharon, thank you for talking to me. Hello. Can you tell me a little bit about what the police are doing here today, please? We've come along today as we're part of the community here in Abergelly. It's nice for us to get to um, 
meet some of the local children who've come along to do some painting. And um, it's just a really thorough, enjoyable day for the community. It is wonderful, and uh, it's nice to see the police involved. Thank you very much for talking to me. You're welcome. The children doing a word search. The words are on the ground and they're just linking them with rope. It's a very popular pastime by the look of it. They're having great fun. Here's Pablo Tree Services uh, making planks for making uh, furniture. Quite interesting to watch. Right, I'm talking to Nathan Jones of Pabo Tree Services. Hello Nathan, thank you for talking to me. Can you just tell me what exactly it is you're doing here? Well, we're trying to make the best use of any fallen timber within the park and recycling it into usable timber for making planters and such like, because in the past a lot of it was chipped up or just firewooded and it has been quite a waste, I would say. Well, that's fantastic. Well, thank you very much for talking to me. Thank you.